So today we're going to be talking about Manny Pacquiao versus Earl Spence Jr. The news broke last night. And let me just tell you this. First and foremost, boy was I wrong when I said that I thought this fight wasn't going to happen. I thought for sure Manny Pacquiao was going to be fighting Mikey Garcia, which is what his manager was saying about a month ago. There was obviously rumors about other people like Bud Crawford, but that fell through. So I am absolutely thrilled about this fight. I'm going to give you guys some of the details and then we'll give you guys a little bit more about my opinion. So the details are it's going to be on August 21st and it's going to be in Las Vegas. My opinion about this is just first and foremost, what a legend Manny Pacquiao is. I mean, this is just a massive, massive fight for him. Some people are saying, well, you know, he's been out of the ring for two years. That's true, but I think Manny summed it up really well when he said, you know, he's older, he needs to take more time off, he needs to make sure that his body is fully prepared for fights, he can't just keep jumping into fights, it's not like he was when he was in his prime, so I think that's a good thing for him, and I think one thing that we always know about Manny is he shows up prepared, a lot of people feel like this is an easy fight, or that Earl Spence should easily win this fight, I will say this, if there's one fighter that has shown us time and time again that he goes in there against a guy that's oversized for the weight class who hits really hard and that people think he has no chance against and then he goes in there and shows us that he can just dominate it's Manny Pacquiao we've seen this guys numerous time and time again so don't ever count out Manny Pacquiao that's for sure it's going to be a super interesting fight to see though because I think Manny has the hand speed to frustrate Earl Spence I think Spence has dangerous power and we've seen him evolve throughout fights and be able to go up through different gears to get guys out of there. But, I mean, this is just a living legend, an all-time great going in there against an undefeated in his prime champion. It, it doesn't get much better than this. And boy, oh boy, am I going to be tuning in for this one. Okay, so that's all I've got for you guys today. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. And with that said, we'll talk to you later. Thanks.